What is up Smack Empire, Smack Empire here and welcome back to another Dark Deception video. Today, finally, we have decent enough content to make a video around and just so you know, I'm planning to make a separate Bendy video so make sure to hit that like button and stay tuned for that. Now without wasting any more time, let's begin. Alright, before we get to our main news for the night, let's quickly tackle small updates that happened over the past few days. As we know, Glowstick Entertainment, the team behind Dark Deception, in the beginning were very keen to keep everything a secret for Chapter 4. And just last week, we had a coming soon page on Steam for Chapter 4. So we're talking a very rare knowledge for Chapter 4. We've had some mobile port release date announcement, as well as a new image for Chapter 4 teaser, which we break down a couple of days ago. Wins Living's the executive director of this game, game after chapter 3 once said that chapter 4 will be by far the hardest level in all of Dark Deception because of the quantity of so many enemies, new levels, traps, just to mention a few names. And with the likes of teasers, screenshots we had, it genuinely feels like this is gonna be the hardest chapter yet. However, Wins made it even worse by tweeting, quote, I didn't think it was possible, but on paper, it looks like chapter 5 might top chapter 4's insanity. Yeah, no thanks, Wins, and here I was a little bit hopeful of beating one, at least one level from chapter 4. And another quickie, after a few days gap, we finally have another chapter 4 OST, this time it's a 3 plus minutes, and it sounds like boss battle theme. Who knows, maybe it's big nurse time chasing you, or maybe reaper nurse chasing us, but nonetheless, I'm putting my cards on the table that it has to do with something dramatic, aka a big nurse's involvement. Let me know what do you think about all of this. Where this OST is going to be used? Boss battle? Just chase theme? Let me know all of that good stuff down in the comments. A couple of days ago, we've had our first look at Chapter 4 Steam page, coming soon page to be exact, and whilst that was a thing, we also got a new, or should I say, updated Chapter 4 cover image. Now before, it was Big Nurse, Joy Joy Gang, and Trigger Teddy, but they changed it to Reaper Nurse, replacing Big Nurse, and adding Mama Bear just behind Trigger Teddy. That was more than enough at that time. I said she looked pretty dead from the outside, with no expressions of real emotions on her face. I mean, what did I expect anyway? She's a bear with a mask on. Anyways, right after that, we Wins Links posted the previous Mama Bear design from Panda One, not the animatronic one, and he said, quote, My old Mama Bear model has been retired. It was fun to make, but we have a new version now. Laughing emoji. It's sad that she's gone, but it's more than terrifying, or should I say petrifying, to think what her absence has brought us. The mammoth of all bears. The doom of teddies. The all eye staring Mama Bear. What? What am I even saying? Wait, what is that? You cannot see her properly. You need HD picture? Well, don't worry. Glow stick again entertainment got you. On their official Instagram page, they posted a brand new picture, quite clean picture of Mama Bear, and boy oh boy, she's looking fresh with that jacket and that jam all over her mouth. Okay, yeah, sorry, that was too far. In all seriousness, it's great to see the real design from this close, seeing that her jacket doesn't have buttons and that it's sued. Actually, before you start firing that comment section, it's a human skin sued onto whatever body she possesses. Also, she has blood, fresh blood on her mouth, which means she just finished eating someone recently thanks to Trigger Teddy and now that you put these two together alongside they really are a great duo aren't they? Hmm now that I'm thinking about it all that's left is Papa Bear and we'll have ourselves a good old bear teddy family ready to kill this member and crawl inside us only to use our skin to sew onto their bodies to hide their true nightmarish realities to then keep doing what they do best and that is slaying people by Trigger Teddies and feeding them to Mama Bear with the help of Papa Bear. Yeah. That was enough for today, let's move on. With that, it'll bring us to the final part of this video. The most important teaser, in my opinion, for Chapter 4, and that was this picture that they shared on both Instagram and Twitter. This honestly came out of nowhere, and as a surprise, too, it shows a very unusual scene. We have Chapter 4 logo in the bottom right corner to make sure that it is Chapter 4. Then we have rain going on, why it's necessary, coming to that in just a second. We are on some sort of bridge, but even more surprisingly, we have police cars, and I see more than four of them. This is honestly big, and I mean, 
main big teaser for chapter 4. Ever since chapter 3, I've been saying that please, chapter 4 is a huge opportunity. Use it wisely to develop Doug's story and if this is what I'm thinking it is, they might have nailed the most important element for this game thus far, the important move in all of Dark Deception franchise. Also, there's a caption that I forgot to mention, quote, show me who you really are. Now, I believe this caption has its two fair share of explanations. However, this caption makes everything so complicated. We're gonna get to that in just a second, but let's see what kind of explanation and theories we can come up with from this teaser. There are two ways we can take this. Number one, and it's a strong one, this is a flashback from Doug's past to set up chapter 5 story and I'll explain why in just a second. And number two, this is a part of Doug's nightmare inception, something that I'm relying heavily towards, slowly but heavily, as the story is progressing to set up his daughter, Tammy Hauser, for chapter 5 or maybe for the 10th portal. Now you guys remember chapter 2. Yes, the Agatha one. This teaser matches perfectly with what Elementary Evil showed us in one of the secret rooms. We believed that Doug, after finding about mental illness of his wife, Christine, he left and abandoned her, only to follow up with abandoning the daughter too. Tammy Hauser, who then died in a serious car crash alongside her mother, but they didn't die instantly in a car crash at first. Alright, alright, I know what y'all thinking, hey smack, what the freak is this? Now listen, I'm a little bit sick, and I cannot do long videos, I mean I cannot edit long videos for a few days. So apologies as I am splitting this into two parts, hopefully it'll be up tomorrow. Again, I apologize, but make sure you hit that like button and subscribe and notifications on because you don't want to miss part two of this important two-part video series. And become an official member of Smack Empire, help me get to 20,000 subscribers, and I'll see you next time. Until then, take care and peace.